welcome back to my channel today i will be doing my weight loss video that has been highly requested and let's just get right into it so i'm gonna start off by telling y'all some of the basics and if you hear people talking in the background excuse them but um i got my phone and my um beyonce thing with all my notes so we can be accurate and on point because I'm going to leave out nothing. I have recorded workouts for y'all. Everything that I took, everything that I did, whatever. Everything is literally going to be in this video. Like, it's going to be super detailed. Like, nothing is getting left behind because I want to, you know, help y'all out. So, let's see. Okay, right now I'm going to my phone to see when I originally, like, started. Started for real, for real. So, we need to spot on. So, my first picture that I took... Uh, um, when I started to die, I think like two days later after I started the well, not it's not a diet, it's a detox. And I'm gonna insert the picture right here of what I looked like. This was day three. Um, so that was day three. Um, after that, okay, throughout this whole video, I'm gonna like put pictures like on either side of like. I'm going to put pictures on either side of what I originally looked like and what I started with and like I'm going to say the dates. But this is me doing like the sit down and like talking about other parts that I didn't talk about or record. I already, I already previously recorded when I first started the diet so like you guys can see me before versus after as well as I have two vlogs on my channel. Yeah, two vlogs. So, you know, if you want to see progression, look at my moving video. That is before I even started the diet. Like, I was at my heaviest that I've ever been. So, what I did was I went to a doctor in Houston. Her name is Dr. Fisher, and she's a natural doctor who, like, can tell you everything that's wrong with you. And, and I went to her, and she prescribed, well, not prescribed, but she gave me all these, um, this detox, which you'll see in the next video. And I did that. I went vegan for about a month. I'm not vegan now, but I still don't eat meat, and I try to stay away from dairy. I eat every now and then, but I, like, incorporated more stuff in my diet, like bread and a little bit of chips here and there, but nothing too crazy. But, like, I'm going I'm to get into detail details, but I'm just giving y'all a little, little background. So, that was first thing first. Me and my mom went to the doctor in Houston, and she told us all of our problems. Like, she said I was borderline diabetic because my blood sugar was very high. When I was in ninth grade, I had high blood pressure. Mm. And diabetes also runs in my family. Um, let me see what else. And she said, like, my colon needed to be cleansed and... But that's stuff that I have been hearing for like a long periodically time. So that's stuff that I already knew. So today is a different type of video. So today is a new journey. Well, this is not a new journey because I've been doing it for five days. Yeah, this is day five. But today I am going to start recording my journey. So basically what I what happened was I went to a doctor in Houston and she was a natural doctor. She like told me everything that was wrong with me and she gave me all these medicines to take. Well it's not medicine but it's a detox and they're all natural so it's not like oh I'm taking this pill and that pill and that pill. It's none of that. It's just a natural detox. And then I have a meal plan as well with it. That way I can lose weight and you know just live a healthy long life because I don't want to you know cut my lifetime due to my eating habits if I can prevent that and I'm gonna just you know bring you guys along with my 21 day cleanse and then after the cleanse I'll just continue to eat clean you know and I might just stay vegetarian afterwards because it's saying no meat at all so if I can eat no meat for 21 days I might as well you know just Stick to it, but you know your girl, your girl let them hot wings. <laughs> but a lot, of, well, really, my immediately family, except for my brother, doesn't eat meat anyway. So that probably would be hard. And then as I'm 21, I live with a roommate. I buy my own food and cook my own food, so that should not be that hard. First day, this is how I felt and this is what I ate and what I did basically so that's that one 
So I'm gonna start off by showing you guys like all the medicines that I have. Let me stop saying medicines because it's really not like medicine. It's just all natural products. So this is I forgot how you pronounce it, but I think it's main man I don't know mango seven whatever something like that. But this is a detox as well. And then I have melatonin, which I give a short background. Like the doctor told me that like I had unbalanced hormones and too many heavy metals in my body. And I, when I was in ninth grade, I had like a dark spot on my neck, which I still do. And they were like, oh, that can be, you know, diabetes. But of course I wasn't diabetic back then, but they just told me, you know, to you know, look out for it and then it runs in my family so yeah so this one is for the liver it looks like that and that's all this stuff and then this one is for the gallbladder this one's for the gallbladder um this one is hmnd I don't know what that one's for, but I don't know. But here's this one. And then the last one that I have says cardio in me. And I'm not sure what that one is again, but yeah. Here's this one. And, you know, it says all of that. And like for example, this one has organic hawthorn berry, green tea extract, organic turmeric, Indonesian Indonesian cinnamon, wild bear garlic, garlic extract, organic cumin, and yeah. So these are all like natural supplements. And normally, I take um I take it at day and nighttime morning and night i take it with water but i put it in a water bottle first and um i like scoop some drops in there which i'll show you guys what i do and i drink that day and night and then at nighttime i take the melatonin as well as these pills so i'll show you how i make the drink so, so over here i have all the medicine and that's everything in my and I use this little droplet to drop it in the water bottle. So let's start off by doing this. And yeah. So I'm doing the living one first. Oops, can't open it. Oh, yeah, shake it up. You have to shake them up a little bit. Oh, it's actually open till I just switch my hands. So I'm going to put some of the drops in here. And I'm going to just show y'all at the end because this is a long process. So I'm going to just show y'all what it looks like at the end. So I just drink this and this is going to be so strong because it's like straight the medicine but I drink it instantly with a whole water bottle because it's gross. It's gross. So I always have to like prepare myself to drink this. Like I don't think nothing can prepare me to take this. Like the, And then it just has an aftertaste. It's just gross altogether. It's just gross. But it's worth it. So I just don't get over it. I mean, you can't smell me, do it, 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 so I'm just showing y'all how I look. Okay, a little background information though. I cannot fit this shirt a few days ago, but let me pull it all the way down so it can just be 100% accurate here. Here's how I look with my shorts not as pulled up over my stomach. And here's the side view. Let me see. Here's the side view. This is how... This is how everything looks without my underwear pulled up over my stomach and whatnot. And we'll do a side view. 
that is it for now. I'm about to put on my gym attire in dip and I will see you guys at the gym. So throughout um, this whole little journey, I wrote in this book and I wrote like, throughout this whole journey, I wrote in this book, well, not the whole journey, but I started writing here like the first few weeks. So like on day one, oh, day one was actually September 9th. On day one, like I ate grapes, um, salad, apples, pineapples, and drunk water bottles. And my moods were, I was less tired. I had more energy and I was way more motivated. Like day two, September 10th, I ate apples, Chipotle. And in my Chipotle bowl, I would get brown rice, brown rice, black, black beans, pico, corn, and lettuce and that's it well i would eat it with a tortilla too because you can ask them for a tortilla on the side so like i ate that for like maybe a good five days because i was like it was hard trying to get used to that having no meat like and that was literally so good to me because that was the closest thing that i had to like having meat or like the closest thing that tasted the same as you know if you were to have meat in it or if you were to not and um i was super hungry that day and I went to the restroom a lot like that was this first that was the second day of the detox so that's when like the medicine well not the medicine the detox started detox and everything out yeah, boy um day three i was really hungry i wanted some fries i ate chipotle and used the restroom a lot as well um, but that's all I'm really talking about, like, I need books. So I'm just, like, letting you guys know that I actually started, like, writing down some things and writing down my feelings in a notebook and writing down what I ate, you know, in case that would help you stay motivated and push you to do the same. So pretty much within a week, I dropped a good 10 pounds. And then within two weeks, I noticed I dropped, like, a good 15. Yeah, I dropped, like, 15 pounds in two weeks. I was really shook. And like this whole process, I just felt really happy with myself. And I was just proud that I finally lost weight and got more confident. So now let's get into my workout. Some people have asked me what workouts do I do, but I literally do the bare minimum. I don't even go to the gym that much. If you eat right, that way gonna come off like that, literally. I don't even go to the gym like the first two weeks. So these are, I'm gonna insert the clips of some of the workouts I did. Like I did the bare minimum and I just now started doing glute activation. I didn't record me doing glute activation and glute workouts because I, I just went along with this one video or two videos I think. And I will put those in the description box if you guys wanna see those. So I didn't record me doing any of those but that's what I, I have started working out the most. And like I said, I insert pictures of me throughout this whole video. And um, yeah, so the, when I go to the gym, the first thing I always do is run a warm-up mile, and I normally, it normally takes me like 15 minutes to run that. I'm trying to get better, trying to get it under 10 minutes, which I can, and um, I have um, the Nike, I have the Nike running app on my phone, so I always start off with a mile, and then I want to show you guys all my workouts that I do. Like I said, it's literally the simplest workouts. Like, I do not do a lot at all. If you eat right, that was the main thing. So, I did all of those. And then, normally, after this clip, after this, I normally go on the bicycle and do a mile on that. But there's a lot of older men on there on this weekend. So, I chose not to record that. <laughs> and you guys know the bike the bike is so I didn't record it but I normally run up I'm normally I normally do a mile on that as well mm, what else
might ask who it belongs to If I was your woman, the things I'd do to you But I'm not, so I can't and I won't But if I was your After that, like, I'm not gonna even lie to y'all, like, at the, um, maybe at the sixth week, four, sixth or fifth week mark, I started incorporating onion rings and tater tots, and, like, I just craved that the whole time. So, I actually cheated, like, for a whole week, like, that's all I ate, but I still lost weight, and I know that's probably not good, but, like, I'm not gonna even lie to y'all, I had cheat days, and stuff but also like if you go to walmart they have a whole vegan food section like literally it's a lot in which i didn't know about so i tried stuff like vegan tacos and they were good at first but i started not liking the meat so it was kind of gross so i gave that up but i'll insert a video or picture of how my vegan tacos came out and then right now today this is my three month mark And I'm gonna keep it real with y'all. Your girl be eating what I want to eat. I still do not eat meat though. That's like the biggest thing. I don't eat meat, but like honestly, I eat fries. Like, but the thing is, even though this might not be good, even though this might not be good, I eat like fries. But like sometimes it'll be like the only thing I eat because me. Ever since I started this diet, I haven't been eating a lot anymore. I I don't feel the need to like eat a lot, and I'm not that hungry anymore. So like. I'm gonna eat some fries or eat Subway without the meat, of course, and then like that'll fill me up, and that's all I eat for the day. So I'm still losing weight just from doing that. I'm not saying do that, not at all. So when I first started, I started off at 225, and right now I weigh 190. Then when I left the doctor, I had a meal plan that she gave to me. Kind of followed that. I didn't follow everything because I was just like, I'm not eating that. But for the most part, I did follow that meal plan that she gave me, and overall. You know, that's what worked for me. In conclusion, the most, if you want to lose weight, make sure you get you some pills that make you go to the bathroom. I'm, I'm going to show y'all the ones that I have. These, these are Mago 7 pills. These are Mago 7 pills. And these are the pills that I take, like, if I eat a crazy meal or something, or, like, my stomach is really low and I just have to go to the bathroom. Say these at night in the morning and get you right. FYI, these expensive. This box is like $25, but it's 180 so I guess you know that even out. But I just make sure I use the restroom a lot. What I put in, come right out. That's how you get a flatter stomach. Um, for the most part, I go to gym about maybe, I try to do four times a week, but I've been busy lately, so I really haven't been going, but yeah. And I'm just kind of happy with my results right now. Like, people be asking me, they be like, what's your goal? I really don't have one. I've already started accomplishing what I want to do. The only thing that I want is a flatter stomach, more toned back, toned my legs. I want everything more toned and my butt enhanced. But, so that's why I've been working that out more than anything. But, yeah, this video sums up everything that I do. And, if you guys have any questions, you can definitely comment down below or hit me up on my social medias, which those will be in the description. Uh, but that's it for this video. That concludes everything that I've done. I showed you guys the workouts and all of that. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!